All right, okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to match day 16 for the Pro Elves. Sorry, the Elven Union as they are now. We've gone for a nice blue and white look. Uh, it's um, apparently it's easy to get the blood stains out, uh, all the tears. Uh, and with this, playing against Old World Alliance, which is the first time we played them this run. And it's Grumplekins, who's got a better fun factor than me. That's outrageous. Grumplekins. Uh, so we're 9, 6, and 0, oh, so this is indie game 16. Uh, and he's 9, 7, and 2. Um, plus movement, blodging, sidestepping. No, no, just blodging. Oh, yeah, blodging, sidestepping, catcher. Uh, we've got offending, tackling, dude. Sneaky get hopeful. What's that? Brawler on both blockers. Oh, okay. Double guard. Where's the blitz? Where's the blitzer? Oh, he's had a new blitzer. Oh. Okay. And what are we? What's my team value? 1450. So he's going to get 50k of stuff. Um, so it's a babe at the moment. Okay. Yeah, fine. Amazing what not living on an island does for transportation. Yeah. Grumple is a fellow Swede. Is he really? Good evening, uh, Kindrin. I'm very well, thank you. Uh, I'm going to try and say hello to everyone in chat, by the way. Keith Abix, good evening. How's the streaming going? Are you uh, you doing well? Evening, Dromo. Hello, Wotan. Lord Wotan. Um, hello, Cauliflower. <laughs> oh, dear. Hello, Theodore Bone. Uh, STX, greetings. Hello, Dazza. Good evening. So he takes the keg, surprisingly. And we've got to decide, are we going to run away or are we going to fight? Oh, uh, we don't get to choose. Okay. True Blood Miniatures. Hello, Mr. Botnot. You're having a great, great time, aren't you? Hello, Trev. Seabraws is here. How's the little one, Seabraws? Uh, right, opponent has, I think, 12 players. And he's got, what, is that a grabbing tree? Is that grab? I can't really tell. I can't click on it, so. It is grab. Right, so it's a one. Oh, okay, so he just one turns. He just one turns. Huh. Okay. Uh, Wotan says, sorry, but I... Sorry, I know I've watched you for a year and a half. And sorry, I know that you're an awesome streamer. And I am and I know, Andy, that you um, have supported a lot of the community in a lot of ways for as long as I can remember. But the first sign of any being able to support anybody else about anything else, I'm off. Sorry, is, is that what you said? Um, who, uh, sorry, what's your name? I forget, sorry. Unbelievable. I've got that little look that knows that I've been mischievous on my face. <laughs> I, I, I know it. Oh dear. Right. So, what we don't want to see is a... Where's my thrower? Where's the thrower? Wolfen can stay on the bench. Botnot is an absolute machine. Uh, how much guard have you got? All your guards pinned. So if you troll slayed me, you're likely to get yourself three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's probably all right. That's probably all right. That catcher, that can go there. So that catcher's protected. So we've got catcher, catcher, catcher. Um, yeah, I think we're all right here, I think. 
I think I'm, I think I'm all right with that. Yeah, let's do it. Zebra says, I tried Dark Elves in Tabletop for the first time ever. I might be hooked straight up 4-0-0 in the biggest Danish tournament except for Danish A Open. Wow. How lucky am I? Wowzers. Congra yeah, congratulations, um, uh, Zebra Wars. It, I, I do find Dark Elves are an addictive substance. I don't think you can get me. So let's just put that tackle there. It, it just makes sure, doesn't it, right? What would happen? Yeah, we've got to make the go for a picky up thing. There we go. We made it. Salamander, thank you very much indeed for the mega sub. Tier 2, thank you very much indeed and happy birthday. Happy birthday. Seems winning is fun and Dark Elves are very good at winning. They are pretty good, yeah. What's that? Dakazzz. No, it's not Dakazzz. DCB here, popping in to watch some Blood Bowl for Mandy Devo. Knowledge is power, use it wisely. It's the Dakar Park. BB Nut, shush now. Uh, AC says, so Andy, do you have time to do a coaching session in my last two games playing Blackhawks? And my KO role has been 18 out of 20 failures. And my goblins have a 60% percent of dirging. And you help them going through those deficits. AC, you are quite possibly one of the most unlucky people I've ever met with respect to dice rolling. Like... I always thought of everyone just as a big blob is sort of around 50%. But what you're demonstrating is that there are people who sit in the slightly unluckier side of things, which does mean that somebody somewhere is dancing around just rolling sixes, pretty much. Which I genuinely find a weird concept. Hello, Hendy. Congratulations, um, Captain Hendy. Dakar versus AWA. Um, yeah, receiving. So I think the idea of, of this matchup is to take the drive and make it last. <laughs> just, just make it last a little bit. But yeah, um, I could do something. I'm, I'm actually off. I've got. I've got nothing planned this weekend, so. Um, I could I could happily talk to you this weekend. You can find a time that works. Hello there. Hello there. Mm -hmm. Um. Here we go. <clears throat> so that's three questions. Uh, Nuke Yoda says, I have a question. There's a possibility you can pull out the sound bites, pull out the sound bites in the YouTube vids. Sometimes they're so loud next to your own streaming sound. Um, oh, oh, okay. I hadn't appreciated they were so loud. I can, we can, we can investigate that, sure. Right. So, so is that that's just come in there, the Anakitty one, was that really loud, or is it just specific some some specific ones are really loud? Where's the troll slayer? The troll slayer's there, okay. So you need to go there. You need to go there. 
Captain, Captain Catchery Pants definitely needs to come further forward. So what I've, what we've done now is we've avoided three turns of of, of playing Blood Bowl, um, and just and just generally hidden. And we'll see whether or not our opponent. How does our opponent play into this now? If you've got, if you know which ones are dead allowed, I could go through and turn some of them down. I haven't got a thrower AC. The thrower's MNG. Otherwise I would have been pinging the ball uh, left and right like some sort of Harlem Globe Trotter. Blitzing. What are we going to take this guy down, or is he going to take the tackle guy? Who did you just hit? Tackle guy. Uh. Hmm. I don't see you following. If I go down there, you're going to be. Three. Ready. Ready. <laughs> you can't come in here not wearing that. <laughs> so he's he's made an interesting problem for himself, which is this, like, gap here. It's no gap. That's no gap, it's a space station. I, being an amazing elf coach, see a gigantic hole in the defence. He still has a lot of problems. Yeah. It's less problematic than it was. Now it's gone to being problematic again. Um, so that's pretty quick. What, a, what, what, a, shush. What have we actually got here? Because this is the turn to actually sit and think this out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, I only have one guard piece. So it means I can't solve, I can't solve all of this. So I could put the guard in there. Hmm. Stand you over here. 2D that. In fact, I think you 2D. Yeah, put the guard in there. 2D that, 2D that. Okay. All right. So the guard falling over is huge. And I'm going to need to not follow this. That falls over as well. It's got Fen, so a little bit of a bind because I can't can't do that. Now, because they've both fallen over, um, we can blitz here and then I can use that diagonal to walk through. So we're going to do that. Ugh. Ooh. Enjoy your 1 and 81. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. 
Don't stick the don't stick the um One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, there we go. One, two, three, four, five. Should go there. Just going to check that no one else can actually hit me. Okay. No one else can hit me. Good. Uh, although, huh, uh, no, that's not true. That goes there. That goes there. We'll leave this. Put the sneaky git foul in. Never mind. Um, turn. Oh, Woten, thank you very much indeed. Gifted us up there. That's awesome. Thank you. Uh, I'll, I'll put, we'll, we'll, we'll chalk those up. That's a, a spin for the wheel. Uh, Penef says, why not just open the left? Did you mean, Penef, why did I not just go through this? Because it certainly was a choice. That, that, like, there was an active choice. I could have gone through this guy. Um, and in, in the end, I actually chose to go through these guys. I think it's... I think I just chose it. I don't know. I don't know why. Which isn't the most insightful, but I did choose to go through there. Hype says it would have taken more movement to go to the far left. Yeah, that's fair. Some, sometimes I, I don't always have um, the answer for like, why did you do this? I, and I feel like I just sometimes, sometimes look at the board and go, that is the right answer. Casual fours. Casual fours. Hmm. So. This is the worst situation in Blood Bowl. There's a surf on the table. Arguably, there's a double surf on the table. So we got we've got a T shape, T shape, um, and nearly a box. But it's turn six, <laughs> and that makes me a little sad panda because that really does mean that I need to hurry up and get on with it. Um, rather than anything else. So we can go... 261 to 100. Sometimes Davo's brilliance can't be explained to us plebeians. <laughs> Sometimes Davo doesn't have a clue what is going on. I oh. think the second one is more prevalent. <gasps> oh, wow. 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 I see what happened there. Unbelievable, Jeff. Right, we're not leaving the ball where it is because that's just going to get surfer, surfer roonied if it if that stays where it is. Um, <laughs> so mean. Um, we're on turn six. That's the blitz. 
that's a block. That's... So that's a block. Maybe that's the blitz. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Need to not. I'm really nervous of that because if I make a sideline cage and I don't break through, I'm gonna, it's going to cost me a catcher. Now we can get the catcher through. I wanted to do a much better dodge. Is there not a better dodge? me that as well oh well never mind it was a two plus dodge fail or it was a two plus dodge fail um you could have gone stand there and you can save that guy and then i can try and get this guy through One, two three four five six seven that was probably the better move wasn't it there 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 yeah oh well uh oh we've got a raid amateur achiever thanks very much for the raid welcome amateur achiever Breakman says, thank you, Andy, for the Underworld Tier 0. Mind Eek was blown. I think they... Underworld, like, if you're using win rate as a thing, they need toning down a touch. So I did tone them down a touch, right? They've actually... All I've done to Underworld is taken 50k off them. It's not actually, actually, actually the world's largest um, slight, is it? And most Underworld coaches you play Underworld are like, eh, I don't know. It's okay, I'll take this tier two. Oh, God. Mike the Machine says, kicking my friends in the sea. Uh, he's, he's, this guy's good, by the way. I don't know who he is, but he's uh, uh, he's, he's, he's no slouch. Um, yeah, so... Uh, Two, two, two or three people have sent that to me as feedback about the go go make this sending off thing a bit a bit better, and so yeah, if if multiple people are saying it right, you it it's got to be a thing. It certainly minimum needs a rewrite. What what I'm going for objectively is that um that the the that if you have more than more more than eleven players on the field, right? Say say me and Jock are playing, right, and we discover that there are more players on the field than there should be. The first and foremost thing that I'm looking for people to do is to reset the board if possible, um, so that so that the advantage is is not a thing. And then secondarily, 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 um, I don't want the person who had to play against them more players to be at a disadvantage. It's incredibly difficult as i'm finding to write this into a rule set um <laughs> uh this is a problem that's got block that's got block so it's some flavor of three plus 
It's just what three plus do we want? So there's three two to get out here. So then two Ds or two D that. How do we do this with the least number of problems? Alright, well that's free. And that's basically free. So back to the same thing over here. Are there any dice that I want to roll? What what does doing something with you look like? Uh, nothing fun. I don't think we want you on the floor. I think it's that. Ponder for a second. Okay. Get you off the sideline. Really don't want to have to give you a two turn, but I don't currently see a way of not giving you a two turn. In it goes. <laughs> uh, post turn four, make it two people and uh, shove them into the KO box. Um, oh dear, I didn't get any KOs back. So the, the NAFC, I don't know if Dan's actually made it public, but um, D for Dan and I, he, he told me what he was doing. My first in initial gut reaction to it was like, whoa, that's harsh. And then um, he explained it a little bit. And I actually then went, I think he's right. I think I'm wrong and I think he's right. Um, which is that his, 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 um, it's supposed to be a bit harsh. It can be toned down harsh, but it's supposed to be a bit harsh. Because the choice between having someone have gain, potentially be able to gain game an unfair advantage and someone I think we have to go like this um not hang on I can't remember I can't remember exactly how it, how it was anyway I think I think my one's too soft I think yeah is 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 currently my thinking um Do I want to go like this? No, not really, but I think I've got no choice. So if my local event on Underworld at tier two, I'd be an idiot to play anything else. <laughs> um, I think Underworld, if you play them in the correct manner, Underworld at tier two are very strong. Uh, I don't, I actively don't enjoy playing them in the manner they're designed. Uh, in fact, like, oh, Ghost Reaper, thank you very much indeed. That's mega kind. Thank you very much. Big cheers. Thank you. Um, Jock and I had a game at the uh, water bowl and he was on he was playing underworld and um i we talk, we talked about it afterwards and it was like he played them like i think how i would play them which was like more of a traditional game and we talked about it afterwards like why do you play this other game like this this just murder ball and they didn't you go and win the next three games jock or was it two wins in a draw? It was like, we played in game three and you just obliterated everyone afterwards. I mean, you were doing well anyway. So it's not it's not like, oh, I spoke to Andy and suddenly everything, no, 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 it's not. I'm just saying that they were very strong.
I actually played Underworld properly at Mulligans at the weekend. Oh, right, okay. Then how did that go? Oh, excellent. <laughs> Who's a lucky Davo? Uh, actually, this gives me the ability to score five players. I'm going to go for this. One. Two. Three. Can't use dodge. I'm going to put the go for it in there. Yeah, I'm going to put the double go for in. Damn it. Didn't break. Uh, what skills have these got? Brawler. So I think a double go for it here, if I make it, is incredibly strong. <laughs> but I didn't, so never mind. Because if you suddenly make that, right, you've got um, uh, a complete loop closure. Uh, what does this thing pass on? A three, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So it's passing on fours so I can't I dare not stand there because I'm just getting punched in the face with tackle I can't stand um, anywhere else so we'll just go backwards I had two one turn attempts made one and failed the other on a four plus pass Uh, nice. Hello, Mr. McFinney. How you doing? Um, nice to have you with us. Uh, are they implemented properly on Blood Bowl 3? Are they swarming? Yeah, defer on the day, are you? I was oh, oh, I was going oh. to go to Bilbao, but I just couldn't find a, uh, a solution that worked. I couldn't. This year's me organising this year's tabletop has been an absolute nightmare, start to finish. Um, as I, I'll be as soon as I've finished organising this one, I'm going to go straight into next year. Um, uh, Jock and I are going to have have words, I think. Good words, not bad words. Like. <gasps> oh no. <laughs> well, uh That's decidedly further ahead than we were a few minutes ago. Yeah, can I have it out in the car park? No, 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 no. Um. So, with a box like this, does that change enough for me? So, grabs that and pushes it there and he just goes through the gap, doesn't he? That's no good. 
locking thing's got sidestep, so it can just go through the gap. I'm not even sure I like I'm not even sure I like separating them actually. Maybe you have to put sidestepper there. Maybe you just put sidestepper in. Maggio says, might try to join him on first of a tournament, see if we can fit it in. Yeah. You need a long job, I'll be in the car parking meal bow. Uh, yeah. Jock, jo you, you and I have some good... We've had some good conversations about Blood Bowl. I am taller than you think because a lot of you see me in a little box like you only think I've got shoulders and a head. I can promise you I've got more than shoulders and a head. <clears throat> He's got an ego as well. Wow. We see the huge ego also. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. So he can throw the teammate. I can't start. I can't stop two different types of one turn. Right, that's basically a natural one turner. Um, I mean, and, and may, maybe actually, therefore, what I should have done was just stuck everyone on the back. Maybe that was the play. Or he can just roll a one in nine. God, he's having some bad luck. He's having some really bad luck. Oh, crap. I've left Dave on the bench. Oh, well. Oh, well. Well, but the Hinos, thank you very much indeed for 46 months. Part of the Rat Pack. So, Jock, I, I always like one, 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 and then one here. That gives me three spare ones, and I put them here. That square, that square, and that square. Always, always a fan of that. Um... Let's go searching for a blitz. Yeah. Is there an objective reason why the defense sets up first? Yeah, the, the setup is so that you can try and make sure that the offense gets some hits in. And I guess it follows the fluff, right? I'm gonna I'm gonna stop you scoring like this, and then you're like, well, I shall try and score. Oh, Santa's here. Hello, Santa. Thanks for the gift a minute ago. Did he just pass turn? Did he? Hang on. Did he?
I don't know. This is my insults as gift, how sweet. Hmm. Well, I don't know if it was a mistake or not a mistake, so I guess we sort of play on. If you pass his turn again, maybe I maybe I'll choose to pass turn then maybe. Don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two. So we would need to cover you. So that goes there. Don't want to just go cover the ball. Shirato Kai 100. It's a bug with quick snap, which sometimes forces you to pass your turn. Oh, so he might have had a... Oh, right. So he's not quit. He's just having an even worse day at the office than you think he's having. Right, yeah. Oh, God. No, no, no. It wasn't a bug. It's not a bug. It's when you've got a quick snap. He's then pressed end turn. It's not a bug. But you're right, I think that's like he hasn't given up. I mean, he might give up now. Oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Right, um, I I get this sense, sometimes I get this sense uh, when I am playing Blood Bowl and, and it's my opponent's turn that I can tell what's going on out there in the big wide world. So for anyone who's just about to go to bed, good night. Maybe that's you, Big Dan. Maybe that's someone near you. Who knows? Anyway, good night to those of you who are going to bed right now. Back to the Blood Bowl. Yeah, Render, see, I, I, you can normally tell. You can normally tell there's a little bit of... That was unsettling. <laughs> oh, dear. Thanks very much. It's definitely not 6am here. Whoa. He's rolled a lot of snakes. Ow. Yeah, I saw there was a, a, a cheeky snake on the animosity roll. Uh, I suppose we'll put you there just to give me options. They were just being weird again, just like they give me money line at Water Bowl. What? When did they say that? I don't recall that one. Right. You go there. You're going to cancel all that out. can now get one on here. I've got to blitz from that square there. Have to. Um, which means that I'm going to be able to push him into here. If I fill that square in, I can't do that. So we're not going to stand you up because it bought, um, I might end up pushing you that way. Yeah, 
Two more D's. Uh, into the hot pot that can go north with a half decent chance of a scatter. Yes. And a follow. Shit. That was not the square I was looking for. Uh, Bango Chicken Bowl 3, we all get a picture with Devo that is not covered by the £10 ticket price. Uh, you all are going to get a signed autograph, yes. That's part of the goodie bag. It's It's been the most asked for feature. <laughs> That's a lie. You're right, it's been the second most asked for feature. All autographs are signed, you numpsy. Really? I suppose they are, aren't they? Ah, oh, never mind. <laughs> Surprised you're not signed autograph. Okay. I think he's trying to free up the elf. Yeah, I think I think that's the play here, right? The play is to to ninja in and ninja off and ninja out again. I'm assuming you saw the new article on the BB23 2024 World Cup. Uh, yes, render, I did. Yeah. Uh, the, the private leagues are very, um, it's, it's not gone the way I thought it was going to go, right? I thought they were going to, what they were, what was going to happen with all the private leagues was going to be, oh my God, your dice are horrendous. These guy's dice are absolutely fucking horrendous. Um, The, yeah, the way I thought the private leagues were going to take this was that the uh, they would use it as an opportunity to massively expand their reach. Some have, I suppose, um, but some not so much. Where are we going to put the guard in here? There is still two Ds here. Let me just come put the guard in. Yeah, let's put the guard in. Throw the two. Throw the two here as well. Where'd the ball go? Who's got the ball? Oh, did you pick it up? Ugh. Well, I mean, well done, Killjoy. That's what I meant. Face and move you out of the fen zone.
Oh, you're on fucking threes, aren't you? There we go. That's everybody. When is Chicken Bowl 3? Um, <clears throat> 20th and 21st of July, 2024. What do you think of the article on the Gnome Star player? I think it's quite interesting. The Gnomes themselves are an interesting addition, and I think they're important for what they signify, which is a continuation of GW wanting to support Blood Bowl. Are, are Gnomes a team that interests me personally? No, not really. Uh, because I'm dirty try hard and I like teams that are good but what I like about the article and, and the general thing is that they are representative of the fact that the game is still going somewhere What if gnomes are an actually good stunty team? Huh. <laughs> uh, uh, they're not, so it's fine. <laughs> I mean, I don't think they will be. Right, one, two, let's you. Let's get this guy up. Let's get this guy upfield. Do you know what we can all do? I'll stand you over there for just funsies now. Uh, it's the strength differential is the actual root of all evil with it, when it comes to stunty teams. That's their that's their actual nubbin of why they don't work. Uh, and their armor. Sorry, it's strength and armor. Sorry, it's both of them. Yes, it's the duality of them being terrible and rubbish. It could be something the illusionist that makes them competitive. I think the the illusionist. Yeah, the illusionists could do, they could do to them what they did to um, uh, snotlings and unintendedly make them very strong in certain specific circumstances. I hope they've learned their lessons from the snotlings and the playtesters by and large are a lot of very good blood bowlers. There is, there is a lot of them that are very sensible. So I suspect that, that they'll be fine. So Andy isn't actually one of them. I'm not a playtester, no, not, not for GW. Oh, I can confirm I don't playtest for GW. Uh, because the rules writer from 2016 is not the same rules writer as that's just taken over. Ah, oh, Blip PSN. Thank you very much indeed for the raid. Welcome. Does PSN stand for PlayStation Network? You horribly human being. The, the garden screen, not you. Not you. There we go. Is that my guy? That is my guy. <clears throat> That's 
my guy. Um, we don't need to let you get punched in the head. And I want to try and score on the uh, the sneaky git because getting him to SG and uh, DP would be would be pretty tasty. Oi, oi, like. Hmm, okay. Fumble League is a go. Yeah, the Fumble League is, is now taken off. Uh, and massive credit to both... Um, JLev and... Uh, Dementor for making that be a thing. Yeah, come on, come on, you're right, that they are definitely a team that gets, that they're, they're very swingy. So if you make them good, what you've done is you've made them really dangerous. Let's just put it in the end zone. So we can put this one to bed. Question now is, is it possible to get another one? Slan are terrible and all the Slan hate is mental. Uh, I haven't actually played enough against um, Slan to know and say whether I think they're busted or not. I like the I, I like Slan existing, but I know that a lot of people, both people within GW and people on the outside of GW, don't. I, I do suspect Slan are a bit of a high rolly team. A bit of one. <laughs> Typical. Ooh. Right. So the idea is to score on him. Oh no, Daz has got a niggling injury. Oh shit. Oh yeah, it, I've I've spoke to uh, spoke to Charlie a couple of times. He does not like Slan at all. So um that's that's not good. Bad it's bad that he doesn't like them. Uh, oh, we should need to pay out the prediction. You guys should be more on the predictions because we could have had a, we could have had a bonus half. We could have had another prediction. There you go. You got a really quick final, final, final prediction, which is: Will there be another touchdown? Yes or no? Right. Just will there be another prediction, another half time, uh, another doodle up bubble? Right, that's the question. Will there be one? Yes or no? You got two minutes. Go. Yeah, my dude got stunned.
I normally get someone sent off. Yeah, Yoda, I do think Slan need... I say, yeah, need. They they really do want uh, doubles skills. Uh, how are you going to do this? So now I suppose what he's got is he can push his here. If this is filled, you don't use sidestep. You can come forward. Like, it's doable. It's just really difficult. I think it's their stats and what they can they're they're capable of doing, I think, is why people don't like them. And I and I say people, I think some people don't like them. It's not a it's not a universal um anti slan bandwagon. New vamps make Slan look bad. Why do you think the new vamps make Slan look bad? Sorry, I'm not sure I understand that. Good evening, um, cheeky uh, Jim, 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 Jim. Hey. So we'll go and put double go for it guard on you. What we'll do is we'll screen. So, right, two re rolls. So there's the blitz. Yeah. Uh. So that gives you something to aim at. Sausage. Oh well, never mind. Slanner Age Sigma. I I'm I, I still am a bit surprised that people don't like them so much. Yeah, didn't didn't old slan used to be big fat fro frogs that used to sit on things and people used to have to shimmy them around they used to get the amazon line women and the um and the the big dinosaurs to move them around that's new slan oh oh yeah i thought that was old slan
Well, if the Blitzer picks it up and he can launch it, we could see a third. Zuma slam. Zoom. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Will we see some wildly inaccurate blood bowl? Oh, yes, silly, silly sausage. Um, right, you go to the end zone because I only care about scoring on you. <laughs> okay, so now you're in the end zone. What are we going to do about it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Throws it to the catcher. The catcher then catches it and hands it off. Seems reasonable. One, two, three, four, five, six. Dodge. Go for it. Throw it then. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's two plus. It's two plus two plus. Doesn't doesn't actually matter how you do this. And it is. A simple two plus to hand it off and catch the ball and that's that <laughs> I think our opponent had shit dice he's not he's not as bad as a 4-0 uh, um, win suggests yeah I he, he was really unlucky he was really unlucky Sometimes you got to shrug your shoulders and say, hey, I'm just really unlucky. Uh, Suki says, what do I think of the Gnome team? Gnomes is good. It shows that the game uh, Games Workshop are supporting the game. Uh, Gnomes are not my cup of tea. Uh, it'll be interesting to see what the actual rules for them are. Uh, so that was match 16. Whoops. Does give me dirty player. And Tree could have block. Do we want another block one or do I want to save for something a bit more spicy? I kinda of want a frenzy one. Tree, you're having frenzy. There we go. Tree's got Frenzy. Tree has got Frenzy. And we've got way too many people on this team. Normally I've got like a big cycle of MNGs that are just not fit for playing. Is anyone broken? Alright, well, we'll get rid of you. There we go. So, three catches. It, if I was playing loads more games where they said I put block on it first, or just waited and got block, uh, frenzy here. But we're going to take frenzy here just for memes. A 
solve the problem about the, the blood pass. <laughs> yeah, the blood pass is dead easy. You just... Hmm? 